Hey guys, welcome to Rosie's Dessert Spot. Today I'll be demonstrating how to create this fun rosette Christmas tree. For the golden decorations, I'm adding some edible gold dust into a Ziploc bag filled with Malteser chocolates. You could use any round chocolates if you like here, giving it a bit of a toss to coat. And voila, you have gold edible decorations to add to your cake. The cake that I created was demonstrated in the previous video, but basically you just want to add a six, five and four inch cake one on top of the other and just trim down the sides. Create a crumb coat with the same color that you're going to use for the rosettes. I went in with green rosettes, so I'm adding a green crumb coat. This is buttercream that I've used for this particular cake here as well. Smooth it out and then grab a 1M piping tip starting at the bottom of the cake and creating these rosettes. Basically to create a rosette, very, very simple. You just want to create a little star and then draw a ring around that star. Keep your piping pressure consistent throughout and then give it a bit of a flick when the rosette is complete just to get a bit of a tight um, finish. On top of my rosettes, I am adding the edible um, gold dust coated Maltesers. In terms of what brand to use for the gold dust, I recommend Rolkem. They tend to have a 100% edible uh, range of luster dust, but it is a good idea to just double check with the packaging and make sure that it says 100% edible. Once your row has been complete, um, create your next row of rosettes. Be mindful though that when you apply your little gold balls just go around the cake and make sure that you like their positioning and that they're all straight. You can press them up or down as you need to to make sure you have a nice straight line. Continue this all the way up the cake until your whole cake has been covered with the rosettes and the ring of Elastic Duster coated chocolates. You could also use um, Smarties here. It's basically the candy coated chocolates if you wanted something a little bit more colorful. But totally up to you. For the very last row, I'm just creating tiny rosettes, just like so, and then adding a star on top. And that's it. That is how you create a really, really easy rosette decorated Christmas tree cake. I hope you guys give this one a go. If you do, I would love to see your images. Hashtag Rosie's Dessert Spots so I can check them out. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.